It's actually, it's a very ancient service. Uh, it would have been quite familiar to Richard III because it's a service of reburial. And in the 15th century, lots of kings and nobles were reburied, moved from one place to another to their final tomb once their tomb had been uh, built and, and was ready for them. So um, it, it would have been familiar to him. It's also based around the theme of Joseph's bones being taken by the people of Israel um, uh, with them to bury uh, in, in what became the Holy Land uh, because the um, promise of the Exodus had not been fulfilled when Joseph died, so the bones were taken. It feels fairly surreal. It's a very unusual service, not something you could have ever expected to do. Um, and it, it, we have to remember this was a human being. Uh, lots of stories about him, bad ones, good ones, but he was a human being who breathed, lived, loved, hated, fought, died, and therefore we have to treat his remains with respect, and he was a king.